Hey guys, welcome to World Travels Today, uh, blog post on Fab Food. We are here near the White House, two blocks from the White House at the Hamilton. We're here to report on Fab Food, although the Hamilton has a lot more to offer with live music, uh, amazing uh, drinks at their many bars inside this very, very large uh, restaurant. So we're gonna talk to our, our uh, server today, Jacob, who's gonna show us a three course meal. He's gonna give you some suggestions on what to order, what to drink, and also we'll talk to the manager who's gonna give you more of a history of the Hamilton. So let's go downstairs and enjoy uh, what this amazing restaurant in Washington, D.C. has to offer. The Hamilton is located on 614th Street Northwest in Washington, D.C., just a few blocks from the White House. The Hamilton restaurant is open seven days a week except for on Christmas and is spearheaded by the executive chef, Sal Ferro. The restaurant accommodates 500 guests with venue space seating and serving an audience of 450 people. The Hamilton opened on December 18th, 2011. Uh, so we're entering our fifth year of operation. Um, we really opened as a, a, we're part of Clyde's restaurant group, and we opened as uh, an alternative to sort of the old Epic Grill, which has been around for 50 years. Uh, we wanted to bring a new vibe to the city. Uh, well, the, the Hamilton is a, is a huge space. We're one of the largest restaurants on the Eastern Seaboard. Uh, we have three different levels. Uh, we have, in our, our lowest level is our concert venue, which is a 650 person concert venue that has two giant bars and a fully functioning kitchen that serves only the concert venue. Uh, and we uh, have concerts three to four nights a week all throughout the year. We also have a full sushi bar. We have an amazing sushi chef named Jason Zheng. Uh, Jason brings in the freshest fish available. I got the day started with a District Cider, which is Leopold Brothers New York Apple Whiskey, Three Pins Alpine, and Fresh Apple Cider with a Spiced Turbinado Rim. My server called this a cider with a serious bite. My friend Ryan ordered a Bloody Mary, which looked pretty good. It was time to focus on food, and we started with the breakfast sliders, which is buttermilk biscuits, house smoked ham, apple butter, and scrambled eggs. This was absolutely delicious. It was time for our entrees and from the brunch menu, I ordered the chicken biscuits. This is fried chicken, two fried eggs, buttermilk biscuits, bacon, and unbelievable sausage gravy. Ryan ordered some delicious chorizo quesadillas. dessert menu. Um, we have our house pastry chef Sally who created the wonderful St. Louis gooey cake and it's like a traditional vanilla cake with chalk chips in it and the top layer has a gooey top and then we put vanilla ice cream and chocolate ganache on the bottom of it. It's a great sharing. I eat it all to myself. It's delicious. All right, what we ordered for dessert is the St. Louis gooey chocolate cake, which is a, a rich delicacy. It's got ice cream, uh, Oreo cookies, and butter cake. So let's find out how good this is. fashion is my favorite because instead of an old-fashioned with orange we do it with a lemon lemon peel which gives it the, everything a little bit of different taste to it Fantastic. a little less not so harsh but a little lemony 